it's going to be a really exciting season. Uh, you know, the women's team has won two indoor Hebs championships in a row, going for their third title here at home at the Gordon Track. It's going to be really exciting. Uh, the men uh, were really consistent last year, finishing third both indoors and outdoors. Have a great group of student athletes back, and again, I think the extra motivation seeing the women, you know, carrying the trophy and getting sized for their rings, uh, the guys would love to, to be in that spot too. So um, it's going to be a, a really fun, exciting season. We're very fortunate to have you know, one of the, the nation's best indoor facilities. Uh, it's a great track, a uh, great place to throw, to jump, uh, just to compete overall. Uh, and we're hoping to have a, a great uh, fan support as well. Uh, hopefully a lot of students uh, will want to trek down across the river to come in and support uh, Harvard Track and Field. We've got a great group of captains, uh, all, all seniors this year, uh, with Ben Glauser and Jarvis Harris on, on the men's side, Ben being a, a two-time captain, and then on the women's side, uh, Ashley Collinsworth and Erica Vedas. Uh, great seniors, they've been big point scorers for us over the years, uh, school record holders, uh, so it's going to be great to be able to have them leading us uh, this, this year. I think one of the real strengths of our program is how balanced we are and how we have uh, key contributors across the event groups. Um, but in particular, I'd say our, our, our sprints um, have really emerged as, as, as one of the, the Ivy League's best, um, and especially on the women's side, but I think the, the men's side is um, really poised to, to do some special things. And um, the throws have always been a, a real strong area for us. Um, I think the, the field events overall will, will continue to be kind of the backbone of the program for us to, to lean on. I'm excited. I mean, those kids have been putting in a lot of hard work this fall. Um, they've had an opportunity to, you know, really take their fitness and um, you know things to a, a different level, and it'll be great uh, as a benchmark to kind of see where they're at, see what things we still need to work on, uh, what things have gone well, uh, and just get a better gauge for for, for where we're at. Uh, it's early um, December, uh, but at the same time, you know, I think that they've been amped up and, and ready to go uh, for for a while now.